Hey boo, welcome back. You're probably wondering why I'm on the floor. It's just been that kind of week. And the kind of week that it's been, it's Friday and I've realized I have not really recorded much of the behind the scenes of the entrepreneur life because it's been that hectic, but I promise I'm gonna do much better next week. So we have something, but the week has been going crazy. I've been out most days this week, just running errands, getting things together for like Black Friday. I had a photo shoot that was six hours today, um, prepping for that, prepping for something on Sunday that I've been getting packages and not opening any of them. And one of them, I don't know where it's from. So let's do a little unboxing um, because who doesn't like a little unboxing ASMR moment. This was from Amazon and y'all know Amazon be shipping stuff like you could have four or five things in your order and they'll ship it several different packages. So, oh, <laughs> this is a random. I thought this was something better, but it's not. This little, I needed something. I needed um, some rat tail combs. So I ordered that from Amazon. That was not fun. I thought it was gonna be a different situation. Um, this might be, this is a work thing. I'll show you this. So I ordered labels and some stickers from Sticker Mule. Um, and it's funny because they, they ship with these like hot sauce labels. So it always looks like my boxes have hot sauce in them. They do make a hot sauce. It's like a sweet hot sauce. And when you spend a certain amount on labels and stickers, they send you a free bottle of hot sauce. It's pretty good on tacos. Just saying, just saying. Okay, so I reordered the labels for the back of the teas. So that's that. And then what else? Oh, and I also ordered these stickers for the chocolate cases. So basically, Chocolates are back on sale on Noir Bud's website, but I also have a pop-up coming up in December. And usually at pop-ups, the chocolates sell like hotcakes, okay? They did send, they sent me samples of the hot sauce. See? I wasn't lying. They actually sell hot sauce. It's good. We we keep it on deck. Sometimes I don't have it come with the order because you can opt out, but then other times when I see what, when we're running low and I'm reordering labels, I'm like, yeah, send me that free one. Send me that free one. All right, we got a Zara package. Earlier this week, I had placed an order that included that red um, faux leather dress. It's like a tube dress. It had that in the order and then something else. Oh, like a Prada inspired bomber jacket and this skirt and I saw a few people have been wearing it and posting about it. I was like, you know what? I'm okay. Let's cancel that and let's just keep this skirt. I'll try it on for you and I'll pop it up over here. But I thought this was really cute. It is a wool. Woo! Woo child. Wool pleated. But some of it is a wide pleat. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put it on for y'all. But I thought this was really cute. It's a midi skirt. I could see this with a couple of different boots that I have, but it's like a high low situation. I love that. I feel like Drees did something very similar. Hey, I'm here for a little doopy doop, okay? I also ordered for the first time. Um, it's a dermatologist, black dermatologist who started her own brand, um, Epilogic Skincare, and these are her products. And I was reading the ingredients and considering like, I have kind of oily skin, but I'm acne prone, um, have really bad hyperpigmentation, stuff like that. So I ordered the total package, um, which I think is, well, I'll go through it. I think total package is the, the skin, the, I can't even talk. I can't even talk right. It is the moisturizer, the master plan, which is like this amazing serum that they've done like several case studies on it. And you can see a major difference in just tone and hyperpigmentation and just like overall structure too um, on their case studies that they had. True Calm and even Essence. So let's look at this. It's beautiful packaging so far i love ordering from companies that have really fun packaging because 
I want to get packaging for Noir Bud and I'm always loving like the inspiration behind these things. So this is, what is this? What is this? This is True Calm. Oh, this is the Rose Hip uh, Face Cleanser. So this is actually a cleanser. Look how cute this bottle is. I think because of the Rose Hip, this is going to do really well for my skin. Um, but this is so cool. The True Calm Face Cleanser what else i love this i love this um this is the even balance look at this bottle guys look at this this is this is gorgeous and it's green look at that y'all better go ahead with this package and this is gorgeous wow okay this is i'm gonna be really i'm not gonna start using it until next week after my photo shoots because like I have another, like I said, another one on Sunday. Lord forbid I don't have the best reaction and I'm looking crazy on camera. This is the uh, Total Package Moisturizer. Again, I love how they have the dots in their packaging. This is so adorable. And I like, I like this. This is portable as well. And then last but definitely not least, okay, Master Plan. This is the Holy Grail. They're saying that this is the Holy Grail. And inside it says the place in which I'll fit will not exist until I make it. James Baldwin. Do they, all of them have something? Oh, yes. I love a James Baldwin quote in the packaging. How lovely. I like that. Okay. Look at this packaging too. This is gorgeous. I'm really happy for I don't I don't know. I don't know the dermatologist behind it like personally. I've seen people that I really respect on Instagram support this brand and they sold it at TA New York store. Um Marjan Carlos did their um like their debut party and that's how I found out about it. and I was like watching their Instagram learning more about their product reading every single thing about it and I was like you know what let me do the deep dive and get all the things so this is gorgeous these are gorgeous things it just I just I'm gonna put it on my sink and just use it real slow <laughs> no I'm gonna use it. I really want to see how it goes on my skin because all the ingredients that it has makes sense for me all right we're gonna keep it going and oh more beauty so y'all know sephora is having their major sale i feel like this happens twice a year um and i already forgot what i ordered <laughs> yeah it's just because it, it's been a little bit it's been i ordered like almost two weeks ago so obviously the sale had them kind of smashed with all this shipping right so i'm a little delayed getting my stuff but that's okay i got the um brush shampoo clean my brushes because you know i said i'm acne prone i have to make sure my brushes are always clean because can't have a dirty brush that will just agitate it more i love 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 super goops um spf watery lotion i was running out child i was running out so i had to get that re-up okay but this for me because i'm already oily this doesn't dry down so like it doesn't make me feel too slick so this was perfect um i love i love um super goops spf like all of them even the one that has a bit of gl uh, glow and and glitter in it for the body what is this Oh, brush cleaning mat. This so this you can put on the side of your um, sink and use the ridges there to clean your brushes to get your brushes super clean. And you put the shampoo on there. And you just swipe, 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 swipe. Even your um, beauty blender, you could clean your beauty blender on that. And it has suction cups on the side on the on the back end, so it could just hold onto your sink as you're washing it. So. I saw my girl, Chris Cavallari, she had this. And I was like, ooh, they have it on sale? Okay, and it's a Sephora brand. So I snagged that. What is this? What is this? Oh, I wanted to try a new eye cream because the one I have is, is ran out and I wasn't really feeling it too much. Um, but this is the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Cream Supercharged Gel Cream. So... It's a tiny thing for a mighty dollar. 
So let's see how this goes. I've never actually used anything from Estee Lauder, but I heard a lot of good things on this. I saw the reviews online also attached to the product that I was like, okay, cause I'm, I am that person. I read reviews, but the thing is I don't take every bad review. Like, you know, sometimes you'll see a bad review about something and that could just mean maybe they didn't read the ingredients and it didn't react to them so well, or, you know, maybe it, when it comes to products, you know, maybe they didn't read the measurements. Maybe they didn't. People don't read. When people don't read, then they end up having a bad experience because they missed a few things that were really important for them to pay attention to. And they overlooked it because they didn't read. So I, I always read um, and take into consideration the people who have skin issues that are similar to mine and how they respond to a certain product. And that that's how I like kind of figure out the the balance of the reviews so i also re-upped on some dior stuff whoops uh what is this what is this what is this um oh so i got the concealer is something missing something's missing because i ordered two concealers um but the Dior Backstage Concealer in 4N, I wanted to try this because this one is closer to what I believe my my actual skin tone, not just my highlight area. Um, yeah, I think I need to double check. I don't see it in my box because I have the one that it does act as a highlight on me. Silver Road, don't play with me. Let's have a seat. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Okay, maybe I didn't order it. Maybe or did they? I'll have to double check. Maybe I'm wrong. Okay, I'm sorry. I'll double check. Oh, okay. Hmm. Um. Also, threw this in there. This was always something that I used in the past. Uh, the Dior Iconic Overcurl Mascara. Just want to see how I feel about these days. You know what I'm saying? So I threw that in there. I mean, it's a sale. So. It's, Come on, and I'm 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 rouge. I'm VIB. You know what I mean. So I threw that in the bag and got that straight away. And then I also ordered the lip glow oil from Dior. I added just in the the regular color because I have a lot of lip glosses that are taupey looking or like slightly pink. And I'm like, I just need something regular. I just want something regular. So this was the clear one. And I did order from Charlotte Tillsbury the Pillow Talk Lip Cheat Reshape and Resize Lip Liner in the, what color are you? What color, what color is this? Is, this, is that, oh, okay, three, intense, that's the color. So it's a dark brown. Let's see. Mm. Well, that's lovely. I like that. I like that. That's really nice. Do you sharpen? Okay. Okay, great. I sharpen you like a regular pencil. Okay. So that is it from Sephora. And now we have this box that I'm like, I don't know what it is. It's long and heavy. Um... And I think like all of my other work stuff already came in and is at the office. So now I'm just like, okay, girl. All right, let's see. Child, this is all the Beyonce stuff I ordered this summer. Oh my God, Beyonce. Wait, y'all. Oh my God, do y'all? So when Beyonce dropped her album, she had a whole Beyonce shop online. Oh my God, I totally forgot about this. I totally forgot about <gasps> all the t-shirts, the blanket, y'all. I ordered a blanket. Judge yourself. I love Beyonce. Oh my God. 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 What? <gasps> I forgot about this stuff. Okay, so I'll show you the first t-shirt. 
I love her face. I love her face. Y'all, we are still playing Renaissance like it just came out yesterday. I know I'm not the only one. Oh my God. Y'all, I am done. Do you see this? Do you see this moment? Oh my gosh. And it has oh, the songs on the back. Wow. I knew it was going to take a while because she's, she's done that before with like shop Beyonce having things on her website and it takes a y'all I'm just I'm so happy I like this I like this little you know little sport t-shirt situation with her face on because I love her face I love her face and I did get a hoodie I am this was a shock I was not expecting this I didn't even see the notification that it was shipped out and then I got a zip up hoodie worldwide what's on the back I don't even remember the horse, the Renaissance horse. How you doing? <laughs> Judge yourself. Oh my gosh. And I don't have a zip up hoodie in black at all. This is going with me to the gym. You hear me? Oh my gosh. But get into this blanket. I don't remember which blanket I ordered. I think there were like two different styles. Let's see what this one is. Ah. Oh, yo, I, oh my God, where does it end? Wait, where does, where does it begin? Oh, okay. Oh, it can, oh my gosh. Wait, I mean. This is insane. Ring the alarm. Literally, ring the alarm. This is amazing. So, we'll let the siren go, but like, they know what's hot and popping. Look at this. Oh my God. So, my idea was in July, I started thinking about moving into a new office because I saw my friend um, Daniqua from Lip Brooklyn. What's up, D? She has an office in this area of Brooklyn that I'm like, oh, my dream office. So like, it's super lofty. It's super like warehousey style. I fell in love immediately. And I was just like, you know what? The goal is I want that big type of space office for me too. Like for Noir Bud, for content curation, for all things, you know? And I was like, I'm damn sure gonna have a couch in there. And I'm gonna put this on the couch. And that was the idea. And it's still gonna be there. I'm still going to get that office that I'm dreaming of. And this is going to go on that couch. It might go on our bed for the time being because I love Beyonce. This was such a treat. Oh my God. <laughs> I was like, what is this? And it says, um, be fulfillment. That's what it says. It doesn't say shop Beyonce. It says be fulfillment. I had no idea what be fulfillment was based out of California. Child, what? I forgot. I have one more Amazon box because, okay. I am shocked and appalled. What is in this box? This is probably some white tank tops I ordered. Yep. Yep. Because y'all know the white, be the, the beaters are. And so I got the boy size medium, just the tanks because layers. I don't want to always wear a long sleeve bodysuit underneath stuff because I've been sweating with those. So I was like, let me get some tank tops instead and wear that underneath there. So something else in here too. Oh, oh yeah, bed head. This is just some hair wax to mold down certain areas. Um, edge brush i ordered this too this can go back i don't need this i don't remember that i may or may not have a problem but that is for me to figure out and y'all to enjoy but yeah guys this is it 
this is cute this is a mix of everything right and like i said i promise next week we'll do a lot more behind the scenes um but you got a little unboxing today and that's always fun so you have any questions comments whatever leave them down below what do you think of these selections that i made because they're all over the board they're all over the board so tell me what you're thinking um did you get anything from shop beyonce tell me what you got baby because i want to know too um but definitely this was cute this was fun and i'll definitely let y'all know about my experience with epi logic stuff because dr genie ton jenna ton genie ton Okay, I'll find out how to pronounce that and I'll do right by her because I don't like mispronouncing people's names and like, especially with confidence. Like I'm not, if I don't know how to say it, we're just gonna skip over it for right now. We'll get back to it later when we are told how to say exactly. But I'll let y'all know how these lovely situations go because this is so cool, it's exciting. Oh gosh. All right, y'all, well y'all have a blessed weekend wherever y'all are and Hit me up if you have any questions or whatever. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, all the good things. And I'll see y'all next week. Bye.